Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Tablets and Technologies. Um, we've been getting a lot of requests about the e-pad, so we figured we'd do a little demonstration via video for you. Um, as you can see, there's the box. Inside the box, you're going to have your power cable. You're going to have an ethernet adapter, which is really neat to have. And you're going to have a manual. Now, the manuals that you normally get are in full Chinese, as you can see. I don't know, I don't know how to read that. But the nice thing about this is it does actually have a English section of the manual, which is great. We can actually read it this time. It's awesome. Um, from from out straight out of the box, you're gonna see the unit has a good feel to it. Uh, I know you can't feel it through the video, but it does have a, a strong feel to it. Um, you can see your your uh, speakers are right there, as with any other tablets and technologies device. You will have the engraving of the company name in the back. Um, what that does for you is it does it, it enables you to get that one-year manufacturer's uh, warranty. Just turn it on for you. While it's loading up, I'm going to leave it right there. Let it load up for a sec. Read you guys off some of the specs. The reason why we're showing this right now is we did have a, uh, a price drop. Um, it's it's suggested to be retailed at 319. We were normally selling it at $274.99, a little bit of savings there between the manufacturer's retail, and it is currently on sale right now for $20 less at $254.99. Okay, we do have express shipping available on this item. Now, as it's loading up, as you can see, it's going to the Android load up screen. Um, here's some basic specs on it. It, is, it does have that ARM uh, 1 gigahertz processor. It does have the Android 2.1. Okay, it is a 10 inch LCD. It has that IPS technology on um, the 1024 by 600 pixel screen, which is a nice feature. Um, it does have the Wi Fi, the VMG wireless LAN, a lot of different languages that are available in this. You can see them all at the website. The memory, the RAM, is uh, 256 megabytes. Okay, and it has ROM of 128 uh, megabytes, and it has built-in 184 megabytes. It does support the mini SDs. Okay, which we have one right here. We actually have it plugged in to ours. It does not come with the device, but they're really cheap nowadays. You can get them on eBay for five, six bucks. Um, this does support all your video types, and the main questions that we've been receiving are, does it do YouTube? Does it have the ability to, to do YouTube videos, and what's the highest capacity that it'll run a YouTube video? As of right now, I would say the highest capacity that we're seeing stable on the device is the 720p as we have listed on the site. We have had a couple videos run in 1080, um, but they're just not clear, they're not, they're not the best. So 720 is, is a great, great one for you to stick with. Um, the battery is a 1500 mAh capacity, and it lasts approximately two to three hours. Now, I don't know if you guys remember any of our other posts that we do. Um, we run our devices when we're testing them at the highest brightness level, and we run them at the full max capacity. We're pumping them, we're having them do more and more um, applications that are normally designed. So on this device, with us running it as, as full capacity, we're averaging closer to the two hour range instead of three hours, as, as, it, as the manufacturer says it can get. Um, as far as that, you are getting the e-pad, the charger, and your ethernet. Okay? Let's get, let's get into the depth with the, uh, the device itself. As you pick it up, you're going to notice that it does have the slide feature. Another thing that it does have is that G-sensor. Where you can actually go into like an ebook mode if you like to, or, or how I prefer to actually uh, view the websites. Um, you can go from there. Okay. Now, whenever you open up an e, e pad, you're going to notice that your Wi Fi does not automatically come on. That is a battery saving option. Okay. Let's turn it on. I went to settings, I went to wireless. Just enable your Wi Fi, just give it a click. Now, this. This isn't going to be a very fair uh, internet show because uh, our router's about five stories downstairs right now. So let's see if we can even get connected. Give it a set. I'm sure to try this before we do the video. Oh, great. We did actually connect. Go back. Okay. Now, give you guys some quick examples. Go to your YouTube app. Uh, 
Um, let's just pick... Let's go right here. Let's just pick one. One at the bottom. Uh, everyone likes Will Ferrell. Let's give him a click. See what he has to say. As you can see, it's pretty fast. Loads right up. You see that good? Alright. There you go. There's your YouTube up and running. Now, another way to access it is if you want to do your search. Just punch in a search right there. Do your search for what you're looking for. From the Google search, what it's going to enable you to do is once you click on videos from there, it'll ask you how do you want to run that video? Do you want to use real time? Do you want to use um, YouTube? And it'll go from there and it's going to ask you once you click on the YouTube, it's going to bring you right to the YouTube video, that app that I just showed you, and it's going to play it right then and there for you. So does it run YouTube? Done. It does. Um, it also has some really cool features. To show